Players and welcome to the operator training of the Hydromus Compact 250. Before we start, I just want to show you the underside of the machine, just to show you how things work. On the underside, we have got your spray nozzle where the water comes out. We've got your rotating brush which agitates the floor, and lastly, we have the suction nozzle where it picks all the water up. First thing you should do is remove the recovery tank which will let you into the solution tank. In the solution tank, we have a solution tank filter, which stops any debris from going down towards your spray nozzle. Fill point for putting your water in. We then refit the recovery tank, refitting your suction hose. On the top half of the machine, we have got your lid for the recovery tank, and we've also got a secondary filter, which will collect any lint. That just sits back on top. Now we're ready to go. For operation, we have got your water spray, brush, agitation, and suction. If we switch on the brush, switch on the vacuum, pull the trigger, it's a backlog operation. Now it's important to remember not to go over any particular point of the carpet more than twice because we want to avoid any shrinkage. Once you're finished scrubbing, you would remove your recovery tank and empty the dirty water. If you need to empty your solution tank, you would remove the emptying tube. Push that in there and then we just switch on the pump. Is fitted back onto the back of the machine. Now, while we've got that off, you have got the option of the upholstery tool. Put the recovery tank back on. Make sure your lid's sealed. For your upholstery tool, plug in your suction hose and plug in your water feed. And now we have to switch the switch to constant for constant spray. Which then lets us operate the water through the hand tool. When you're using the upholstery hand tool, have the suction on. Once you're finished with the hand tool, unplug and refit your pump plate. On the back of the machine, cable strain and we've got a visual aid for step-by-step -step guide for operation. For storing the machine, undo the two handle knobs and that lets you Flip the handle over for storage. And that completes the operator training for the Hydromist Compact 250.